Yep. Okay. Ready. Start. Okay. Scarby tomorrow in Shantytown. Hier am dritten Tag beim Londoner Internationalen Ska Festival. Und wir sind hier mit äh, Napoleon Solo. Äh, vielleicht könnt ihr euch einmal vorstellen. Maybe you can introduce yourself uh, to the listeners of Radio Shantytown and Scarby tomorrow. Yes, hello there. My name is uh, Soran Christensen and I'm from Napoleon Solo. I'm the lead singer. And hello, my name is Jasper Jorgensen and uh, I'm a singer and a guitarist. Okay, well, maybe you can describe the feeling uh, of your gig and uh, how it was. It was really great playing here. We played back in uh, 1988 uh, at the uh, the first London Ska Festival. The original one. The original one. Yeah. So that's uh, that's a long long time ago. Yeah. And it was great being back and uh, playing again. It was wonderful to come. Okay. Can you tell us uh, if something has changed or is this still the same vibe? Can you tell us something? I mean, you've been on the first one. Yeah, uh, well, it's uh, the age of uh, our public, uh, our, our audience has changed a lot. Uh, they're, they're the same age as us, yeah. uh, 40 plus uh, years. And uh, well, it's, it's fantastic to see so many, uh, so many middle-aged guys uh, and girls uh, coming to a, to a gig like this. I yeah. think it, it, it's a mixture. It's just both give some young people and, yeah. and of course a lot of uh, original fans that kind of follow the music. How did it come that you uh, invited to, to play here? Well, as, as uh, Sun said, we, we played in '88 uh, and uh, we, we sort of kept uh, contact to uh, the arranger, Sean, uh, Sean Flaudieu. And uh, when he was uh, putting on this uh, festival, um, he asked us if we'd like to come back. And of course, yeah. 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 You, you started to play again two or three years ago, is that right? Yes, we were formed in 1984, yeah. so that's a long time ago. Yeah. And uh, then we played for like 10, 12 years. Yeah. And then there was a break for 10 years, and then the band was uh, reformed. Yeah. As a short version. For, for, for a short period, uh, <coughs> and people, people uh, had, had uh, little children and they didn't have the time. But now uh, our children has become older and now we have the time again. And uh, we reformed uh, again uh, two years ago. Uh, the the uh, children um, like what you do? Actually, I, I say my, my children, I'm, I'm very lucky because I, I didn't in any way try to force them into kind of, you must like Scar because daddy used to play Scar and stuff like that. But they kind of discovered it themselves and uh, went to some concerts and listened to some of the music. And they kind of really dig it. So they're, they're kind of, uh, they, they come to some of the concerts in Denmark and they're kind of proud of that. So that, that's a really great feeling. Yeah. My children are, are a little <laughs> too, too young. Okay. Um, my, my oldest son, uh, he, he thinks it's uh, sort of cool that I play in a band, but uh, he doesn't like the music yet. Okay, <laughs> maybe later. Maybe later, yeah. yeah. When he grew up. <laughs> okay, um, yeah, you said you had uh, some concerts in uh, Denmark, so uh, I've never really heard something about Ska from Denmark. So is there a little scene or something? Um, There's actually a quite good ska scene in Denmark. Um, I, I know from the anyway. Copenhagen, in, in Copenhagen uh, ska festival. Yeah, yeah, the Copenhagen area. That's actually a quite a good ska scene. Yeah. Okay. We, a lot of new bands. Can, can you name some uh, some good new bands? A, a very good band is Baby Love and the Fandangos. Right. Yes. yes. They're very okay. very good. Yeah. Uh, they're, they're, they're a little uh, on the reggae side, but they're very yeah. very good. Okay. Nice. And uh, we've got uh, what they call all the bands. Uh, Oh, we can't <laughs> Yeah, the young bands. The young bands. Uh, yeah. There are a lot of young bands, but okay. Yeah. The, the guys have to find, find out by themselves. I think the best uh, should be to go to Copenhagen to the Ska Festival. Yeah. Exactly, exactly. That so, would be a very good... Yeah. Uh, Copenhagen yeah. Copen Copen uh, Ska Convention. Every Easter. Yeah. It's every Easter. Every Easter. And uh, it's uh, on uh, right now. Right now. In, in okay. Copenhagen. Uh, yeah. Some bands are playing in Copenhagen right now. Yeah. But uh, we couldn't be there this year because yeah. Yeah. we had yeah. to go. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah, of course, of course. And are there any plans uh, to do a uh, new album? Or do you have recently released something? We uh, are just about to release uh, a remastered edition of uh, our old uh, album called Shots. Yeah. And uh, in a month, uh, we'll have a uh, one track out. Uh, it's a, a supporter song for uh, the football uh, club uh, FC Copenhagen. Okay, right. 
So that's uh, quite inter interesting for us. Yeah, so, so it will be played in the stadium? Yeah. Okay. Hopefully, hopefully, well, we, yes, we, we, hope like to, we hope to <laughs> play, the new play in the stadium uh, yeah. ourselves. Okay, yeah, that at, would be great. Uh, at their party, uh, the, the, yeah. the gold party, because uh, they're winning uh, yeah, uh, uh, the Danish Cup yes, this year. Yeah. Yeah. The Danish Cup and the uh, championship as well, by 20. Yeah. Five yeah. points or something. Yeah, yeah. they're, yeah, they're, they're huge. Yeah. They're very, uh, very yeah. far ahead. Yeah. But, but our general ambition is definitely to make some new songs and yeah. uh, hopefully release a new album. That what, would be great. What, what kind of style will that be? Ska. Ska. Same. Just, Ska. Just with a bit of soul. Yeah. A little bit of uh, soul influence, but uh, I think we'll, we'll try to stay on the Ska side. We, yeah. We've discovered yeah. that um, that's what we do best. Yeah. Simply. Okay, well, very nice. Uh, thank you for the interview thank and you. have fun at this night. Eh? Thank you, Arne.